So how old is your child? I have boys, 10 and 13. Yes. And we've been through the tantrums, the potty training, and now we are at the household chores. Yes. And my problem is trying to get them to do those household chores routinely. I've tried your charts, I've tried the tickets, stickers, rewards, uh, payday, and the most recent, advanced payday. I'll give you $7 in your hand. It's in your hand. Will you do it? No, it doesn't work. And I have evidence as well. There's clothes on the floor. Dresser drawers are open. Across the way here, we've got some clothes that didn't quite make it to the hamper, but laid right in front of the hamper. The trash, which apparently if you smash it, it's not full, but that looks pretty full to me. We've got dishes in the sink. You've got dishes in the dishwasher. You go ahead and open it. You take out what you need, and the rest falls out, and you leave it. Looking forward to that household harmony. That's your favorite one? That's my favorite. Going downstairs to the dryer because they might need a socks or a pair of socks or something and everything falls out onto the basement floor. Yep. But we'll just take what we need and, and you know, we'll leave everything out. And when they decide they're doing nothing, who does it all? I do. <laughs> okay. Who relates when... to that? This thing. <laughs> <laughs> and when you decide that you are going to give them the advance money, do they take it? Yes, they take it. Of course they do. Of course. And do they do anything? No, I've tried. I told them I would find them a dollar for every time I went by. And did you? I, they wouldn't have any money. Left, and did so. you? No, I did the, I did the warning. <laughs> I did the warning. They're walking all over you. That's why. You, your words are hot air. They're like, they're sneaking into the bedroom going, yeah, we've got mum covered. There's no way. Here's what you do. I'd like you to tell me right now all the things that you put in their life that they absolutely love. What is it that they love to do that you, every week you are mindful of? Uh, sports. Yeah. They do their sports. Mm -hmm. um, and I, I don't want to take that away because I love the sports no, of too, course. of course. And then video games and computers, yep. gaming, that is right. another thing that they do a lot. Okay. So use the chart productively because hanging a chart on the wall is not going to make them do their chores. The chart that I talk about putting on the wall is to distribute the responsibilities. <coughs> Be fair as a mother, okay? You can't expect kids to do things that you've not taught them how to do, okay? You've got to teach them first. And secondly, what I want you to do is to be able to put a list of all the things that they do do. OK, and actually they are old enough for you to sit down and actually say to them, we you, you have videos you play, you know, on your computers. We are out doing X, Y and Z every week. And this is what we do want you to do. OK, otherwise that's going to stop. You have the privilege of being able to do all of these things. And we love that. We are your parents and we want you to be able to do that. But this is enough. Unless you mean it truthfully they will think that you're not being serious and they will continue. So you do have to act upon that to be taken seriously. Otherwise, you're going to be back to square one again. I can guarantee okay. you that. Thank you. I can promise Thank you, you that. You. <laughs>